Thanks for watching this Mapbox how-to video. In this video, I'll show you how to create and edit data in Mapbox Studio. For example, I've created two point features and two polygon features in this custom data set of Brooklyn restaurants. Let's go. So once you log into Mapbox Studio, you want to click on the data sets section. And here we have a list of data sets and we'll click this button for making a new data set. And blank data set is selected because we're going to make one from scratch and we'll call this Brooklyn restaurants. So we've created a new data set and we're here in the editor and here we can uh, see some buttons up here in the top left for drawing points, lines, and polygons. So three different types of uh, spatial data that we can draw. Uh, so first I'm going to zoom in on the area I'm interested in creating data around. So we'll go to Brooklyn and I will zoom in a little bit more um, to an area called Dumbo that has a couple restaurants that I'm interested in. So let's click on draw a point and I'll drop a point here at the front of this first restaurant and then I'll click uh, draw a point again and make another one. Um, so you'll see that there's a button here that says add property so I can click on add property and just start entering key value pairs. Um, so this one will be Fulton Burger And we can click add another property and we can make a cuisine and this would be burgers let's go click on the other point we drew add the same properties so this will be name Juliana's and then under add property we'll say cuisine and we'll call it pizza okay so I've created two point features um, I can now draw some polygons, so you can do the same with lines if you like, um, but to draw a polygon we click the, the vertices and make sure we close the polygon by clicking back on the initial point and you'll see the same uh, button for adding properties, so we can do the same and say name Juliana's. Let's add one more polygon for the building next door. And just like we did before, we'll close it. And add a name property. This one will be called Fulton Burger. All right, so we've created four features, two polygons, two points. And we're ready to save the data set. So let's click Save. It's going to tell us uh, what changed. So this is a new data set, so we're adding four features. We're not modifying or deleting any. So let's hit Save. And the changes are saved. Uh, but before we can use this data set, we have to export it to a tile set. So we'll click the export button. And same thing, we want to name it. But tile sets basically were what makes it usable in uh, Mapbox GLJS or in our Map SDKs. Uh, so it's something that will convert this data set into a usable format uh, that you can use in the rest of the Mapbox ecosystem. So let's hit export. So we'll get a little notification down here, lets us know that it's processing. In a few moments, it'll be done. And then this data set will have been converted into a tile set, which is ready to use. So we can exit the editor by clicking this go back button. And now we see the Brooklyn restaurants data set is on our list of data sets. And under tile sets, we also have the Brooklyn restaurants tile set, which we exported. So now you know how to create and edit data in Mapbox Studio. Thanks for watching and keep building with Mapbox. Okay.